Hello and welcome to this special announcement video in which I discuss the Booktubers Reading Chunksters for Charity Challenge. I have 12 long books or series on my bookshelves that, that I have not yet read. So in 2020 I have decided to turn them into the Booktubers Reading Chunksters for Charity Challenge and to invite the booktube community to join me in this exciting challenge. In the year 2020, I have decided that I want to use my hobby of reading to serve a constructive purpose. My adventures are adventures of the mind, so I'm never going to climb Mount Everest. I'm never going to walk across the Sahara. I'm never going to sail around the world in a yacht. I'm never going to trek to the South Pole. And I'm never going to run 12 marathons in 12 months. We book lovers would never do anything as foolish as that. No, our folly lies in another direction. For the challenge, I've chosen books or series on my shelves that are at least 800 pages long, apart from the first one, which is slightly less, but most of which are considerably more. So, for this challenge, I have designated a chunkster as 800 pages or more. The challenge I have given myself is to read all 12 during the year 2020 at the rate of approximately one per month and to donate £10 to Book Aid International for every book or series I complete in the challenge. A challenge, sh challenge should be, well, challenging enough to be worthwhile but not so challenging that it is impossible of attainment with some effort. Before I share the books I'm going to read, let me tell you about the purpose and plan of the challenge. The purpose of the challenge is that by cultivating community and connection among our booktube community, we will read chunksters or the, the equivalent number of 800 pages or more over several books for the purpose of supporting the work of Book Aid International, which is a book donation and library development charity. Their vision is a world where everyone has access to the books that will enrich, improve and change their lives. This is a vision that every booktuber and book lover can wholeheartedly support as it espouses our values and love of books. Whether you are a viewer, a commenter, a subscriber or a content creator, you are a participant and everyone is a vital and valued member of our booktube community. Before I explain the various ways in which you can participate in this challenge, let me reassure you by saying that this challenge can be done in conjunction with any other reading challenge that you may be participating in throughout the coming year. All you have to do is to designate 800 pages or more of your reading to this challenge. So first, one, simply read along with any of the following books I have chosen for this challenge. And do not underestimate the value of providing moral support. Choose your own chunkster or chunksters or their equivalent of 800 pages or more over several books to read from your own shelves in 2020 and share with us what you are reading. 3. Pledge in the comments below and then donate a sum of your choice for one or more of all the chunksters that I complete in the challenge. I suggest any amount from £2 to £10 or the equivalent in your own currency. If you prefer to pledge anonymously, you can do so in the info cards above. 4. Pledge and then donate a sum for every chunkster that you complete in the challenge. One way you can do this, as I have already suggested, is to read several shorter 
the books or a series that total 800 pages or more. 5. If you prefer, you can make a one-off donation to fulfil the challenge. There is a link in the show notes below. 6. If you have a booktube channel, let your subscribers know about the challenge and of how you are participating and use the following hashtag Chunksters Reading Challenge. You can copy and paste it from the show notes below or from the discussion tab here on my booktube channel. 7. Let me know in the comments below how you plan to participate. 8. Watch Ben Ockrey on why he supports B Book Aid International. There is a link to his video in the show notes below. 9. Watch the YouTube channel for B Book Aid International to gain an understanding of some of the work they are doing. There is a link in the show notes below. 10. Share this booktuber's reading chunksters for charity challenge video on your social media channels. There is a dedicated just giving page for this challenge. All donations will go directly to the charity from the link which is in the show notes below. There is also a dedicated Twitter account in which you can follow the reading and donation progress of the challenge which you can also find in the show notes below. And all the links will be placed in the discussion tab here on my booktube channel. And this video will be displayed at the top of my home page here on my booktube channel throughout 2020. Now these are the books or series that I'm going to read and I've arbitrarily decided to read them in order from the shortest to the longest. 1. The Religion by Tim Willocks which is 771 pages. 2. Daniel Deronda by George Eliot, which is 805 pages. 3. Orley Farm by Anthony Trollope, which is 825 pages. 4. The Newcomes by William Thackeray, which is 844 pages. 5. Quicksilver by Neil Stevenson which is 916 pages. 6. Les Miserables by Victor Hugo, which is 981 pages. 7. The Towers of Silence and A Division of the Spoils are the last two books of the Raj Quartet by Paul Scott, and they are 990 pages. 8. Within a Budding Grove and The Germantes Way are books two and three of In Search of Lost Time by Marcel Proust, and they are a thousand and fifty eight pages. Nine, The Wheel of Fortune by Susan Howitch, which is one thousand one hundred and fifty pages. Ten, A Breath of Snow and Ashes by Diana Gabaldon, which is one thousand four hundred and ten pages. 11. War and Peace by Leo Tolstoy, which is 1,440 pages. 12. A Horseman Riding By by R. F. Elderfield, which is 1,661 pages in three volumes. The total number of pages is 12,828 so divided by 366 my plan is to read them at the rate of 35 pages per day. I hope you will agree with me that this is a fantastic opportunity for the booktube community to come together and to contribute to those who do not have the blessing and privilege of having access to inexpensive books. It is an opportunity to read with a purpose and for a purpose and to share our love of books with a wider community. It is a wonderful opportunity to help the underprivileged to discover and enjoy the wonderful world of books. I believe this is a worthwhile and valuable endeavour and I look forward to your joining me in 2020 
so that our wonderful booktube community can share our values and love of books to make a constructive contribution to the lives and education of people everywhere. Let me know in the comments below if you share my 2020 vision of cultivating community and connection through this booktubers reading chunks for charity challenge. And now here is a quick recap of all the books I will be reading in the challenge.